Welcome to Fun Islamic Facts, where I share fun facts about Muhammad and the Quran whenever jihadis go on a killing spree. As we saw in Fun Fact 3, Satan pees in your ears. But where does he stay at night? Sahih al Bukhari, 3295. Narrated Abu Huraira. The Prophet said, If any one of you rouses from sleep and performs the ablution, he should wash his nose by putting water in it and then blowing it out thrice, because Satan has stayed in the upper part of his nose all the night. Muslim commentators are careful to note that Muslims must really believe that Satan stays in their noses at night, because they have to believe what Muhammad said. Even the commentator for this edition of Sahih al-Bukhari declares, we should believe that Satan actually stays in the upper part of one's nose, though we cannot perceive how, for this is related to the unseen world, of which we know nothing, except what Allah tells us through his messenger. Notice that Satan not only stays in your nose at night, he can also be flushed out with water. So Satan is physical, or can at least be pushed around by physical substances. But there's a problem. There are billions of noses in the world. The only way Satan could be physically present in billions of noses is for Satan to be omnipresent. Omnipresence, however, is one of God's attributes. Hence, according to Muhammad, Satan is either God or he shares at least one of the attributes that are supposedly unique to God. And Muslims have to believe that Satan shares God's attributes because they have to believe what Muhammad said about the unseen world. By claiming that Satan has God's attributes, Muhammad committed shirk, the worst possible sin in Islam. And by believing what Muhammad said, Muslims also commit shirk. So, Muslims are following a mushrik and have become mushrikun. So you wash your hands three times and then you pull the water up your nostrils and take the water off again three times. Why? The Prophet said that the devil sleeps on your nostrils. I, didn't, I don't see any, anybody bothering me or sleeping yet. Well, you don't see him. So you have to believe in this. And, you, and I do this, you do this, all of you, of course, do this, because it's part of the sunnah, and we believe in the unseen. 